we're running a little behind schedule, so we'll get straight into it. I'll just introduce, uh, for the benefit of the press, you're all aware of our Dean of GMC, Dr. Bandeka, our District Governor of Rotary, Gauri Stone. On my right, I have Proterian Raju Marathi, the President of Rotary Club of Panaji, which is the oldest Rotary Club in Goa. On the left of our Dean, we have uh, Proterian Nita, who was the president of Rotary Club of Margao Midtown. And then we have Dr. Vaishali, who heads the uh, Vaishali Doshi, who heads the pediatric department of uh, GMC. A quick prelude before I give it to the dignitaries. Uh, we were approached during the second wave of COVID last year about helping GMC through Gaurish Bhai, through Red Cross, as well as Rotary. There are a number of projects we've already done at GMC and the Super Speciality Block. But one of the things that we were asked for was to give a lot of oxygen concentrators and beds and so on and so forth. So we got the approval, as you can see, for a value of $80,000. But at that point in time, by the time the money was dispersed to us in Goa, we were told that the requirements were not for oxygen concentrators or beds for that matter. So we were then asked whether we could support the pediatric department. So in Rotary International, there was a little bit of a delay in terms of processes of changing once you get the money. So that has taken a while. Uh, I must also thank Padma Jama, who is here with us today. She is the vendor who was chosen and she's been absolutely amazing. I would request the press to also talk to her to understand the equipments that um, she is procuring and selling in Goa as an entrepreneur. So with that, um, I'll hand over proceedings to our district governor, Dovishwe. Well, good evening, friends. On behalf of Rotary, uh, District 3170, uh, we have about 142 clubs with 6,677 members precisely. The entire Goa, the southern uh, Maharashtra and northern uh, uh, parts of Karnataka. And well, these are, this is one of the global grant projects which is being here in Goa. We have done a couple of them now at the moment. Uh, we are doing three in uh, in Kolapur. Uh, we are already one with Kaniri Mud. There's a multi uh, equipped vehicle which has been given there. We are giving one vehicle with mammography and uh, X ray for Siddhi Vinayak Hospital in Miraj. Uh, we are Kardec ambulance coming down uh, in Kolapur again for um, Desa Hospital. Uh, he's a cardiac specialist in Kolapur, one of our very old cardiologist in Kolapur. Uh, we are doing one human midman doctor at uh, D.Y. Patel Hospital in Dharwar. Uh, that's the only second human midman after KLEs in, um, in in that part of uh, in, Kal uh, in, the, in Dharwar. Uh, we are also doing one multi-purpose vehicle in Margao at the moment thanks to uh, Lenny Dicosta, Dr. Lenny Dicosta. Uh, uh, it will be a multi-purpose vehicle where even ophthalmic, uh, gynec or any other there will be cabins inside. So that vehicle are costing about 30 lakhs of rupees. Uh, we have uh, again Kim's uh, Karnataka Institute of uh, Medical Science in Hubli where they require warmers and incubators. Uh, we have been doing a huge project there again. Uh, we know now it's okay but another 20, 30, 40 years we are going to fight for water. So we have taken, rotaries have taken this year very seriously on water recycling plant. And uh, believe me, we are doing 12 recycling plants costing $1 million this year. And we, we have started with all government institutions. Uh, Belgium we are doing with military, the, the hospitals in some Karnataka, Maharashtra. Again, Goa we are doing two recycling water recycling plants. The water is absolutely clean. Except for drinking, you can use it for all other purposes. Washing, flushing, gardening, mopping, everything that water can use and, and uh, it can be used. So, uh, uh, as you know, this year we focus more, Padmaja, as you rightly know, we are focused more on medical services, uh, happy schools and giving whatever best we can. Even she has given, uh, we have done one small project for uh, Chikli Hospital. Uh, entire gynec, the OT, everything has been published there for the gynecology department, right? 
and uh, mapsa zero again uh, we have done uh, entire cardiac the uh, tmt machine as a dollar almost about 42 lakhs of rupees so wherever we go i see that we give maximum to healthcare so that the poorest the poor and you know about gmc uh, that's a, one of the finest institution i can say i am proud of all who have been working here right from dr bandekar vaishali they are gem of people uh, put their hands together you will not find any more better doctors here in goa uh, even if you ask me i i prefer to come to gmc even my angiography angioplasties are done here also i have got a huge sizeable in medical insurance but i don't take risk at all so there's the trust and faith what we have in gmc so i know whatever equipments today we are giving to the pediatric department thanks to dr mini sikwera who initiated initially with me and she she has retired and vaishali joshi has taken over i'm sure you are going to make best use of this equipment under your leadership in the department uh, please feel free in case you need anything these are all been warranted i mean the service warranty is for 3 years right padma ja be very clear so that is very mandatory in whatever we rotary do we see that it's been it's been service for first 3 years by it's building so that fourth year the gmc takes over so there cannot be any complaint for first 3 years so you be rest assured uh, we can catch hold of padma ja bring her here and get the things done so thank you dr deen uh, dr bandekar for giving us this opportunity to come and do something for goa medical college and we look forward working with you again and again and my greatest thanks to uh, rotary club of margao midtown panaji uh, and especially dr lenny who gave personal uh, contributions towards the foundation and of course all my stalwarts who have stood behind me like ajay rajesh every time and now we had to correspond and uh, do a lot of uh, letter writing businesses emails and all so that things were not getting it was getting stuck somewhere but maja was on our head hey given order given order this is going up but money was there from november doctor money came into our bank in november last 28 but we couldn't give a release of payment because the scope of equipments had not been changed so we got an approval and immediately thanks to padma ji she had patience to wait and uh, of course when bajju mitta people are not here this is why i could take their name but they also supported us for this project and uh, god bless you my dear friends thank you i would rather request uh, dr dean uh, uh, to just say some few words uh, and and give us a, a words of encouragement so that we can come again and again and do something more is the governor of uh, rotary and my good friend kavish dol rotarian mena rotarian raju rotarian neeta and my own hod of pediatrics dr vishali and all of you sitting here rotarians i can see your big hearts we call it in medical term as cardio medali to the heart which is ready to donate lot of things to others you know it is said in sanskrit the happiness lies in giving not in taking and that is a lesson i have learned from my good friend rotarian gaurish goa medical college has a long association with rotary club and many a times they have come to rescue whenever we needed their help if you see government is doing lot of things to go medical college government is spending crores of rupees but at the same time such help is needed basically because the workload is increasing if you see now nicu we are building up a new nicu our nicu is always overloaded we don't have beds and poor patients cannot afford to go in a private nicu because it is very costly every day expenses come to around 30 40000 and nicu business doesn't end within 3 4 days the child is admitted for more than uh, 15 days 20 days so in such eventualities these equipments will come to a great help even we can convert some of our beds in the ward and make them high uh, high dependency beds 
and I would also request uh, Vaishali to consider this poss uh, possibility. Basically, because when we say there is no bad, you go to private. If you're saying that word, we should say, yes, we'll try and make this bad as a kind of uh, critical bad and use this equipment. I assure you that these equipment will be used for the best of human care and they will be also used optimally and they will also be used as if they are our own. Means we are not going to, and I know Padmaja, even after three years, I'm going to eat her head. Mm -hmm. saying that you have to come and maintain it and uh, I know that these equipments come from a good company nothing will happen to them and uh, please bless us all the time with rotary blessings and whenever we are in need we will approach you and a big thank you on behalf of all the doctors nursing staff and the staff of Goa Medical College for such a wonderful help thank you Good evening to all the dignitaries, the Rotarians, uh, our respected Dean Sir, Dr. Bandekar. At the outset, I would like to express my big thank you from my whole department to this gesture which has come from the Rotary Club. Thank you very much. In fact, we had approached the Rotary Club through our ex-HOD, Dr. Mimi Silvera. And this process was initiated since then. But as you can't avoid certain delays which have happened in this, but it's, as the saying goes, it's never, I mean, it's, uh, yeah, you receive it, it's always useful at any point of time. Okay. And at GMC, we face this crunch always, especially with our NICUs as being mentioned, that we are always overloaded. So we have to send back many babies, especially we are seeing a lot of immature babies, a lot of extremely low birth weight babies who are in need of all these monitoring equipments for better patient care. So a big thank you to the Rotary. Thank you very much. And we are sure that these equipments will go a long way in providing good care, better care, so that we have further improved outcomes and it will help us to further improve our statistics in terms of uh, especially bringing down neonatal mortality, which we are already at a very low level if we compare with all other states, but uh, definitely we will try our best to get it down further. Thank you. Thank you, friends. Now I'll request a uh, uh, dean and district governor to please come forward and probably cut the ribbon. I would also request Adrona, the current president, to also join us, please. Excuse me. 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 Where are labor? Thank you so much, Dean Sir, for inaugurating and accepting our small gift.
said it must be. Much easier. Yeah. Sir, a box hand over question. Hand over question.